Joined by General's Head Coach Scott Abel following a 34-21 win over Shenandoah. Coach Abel, some thoughts on uh, today's game and going 10-0. and Well, you know, uh, first a little bit about today. You know, it was really kind of a tale of two halves. You know, uh, offensively in the first half, you know, we we did what we wanted to do, but just couldn't put in the end zone, made some mistakes, turned it over. But defensively, what this probably hadn't been a finer effort in a half all year defensively. They just really got after it, rattled Shenandoah. Uh, unbelievable. And then second half, we got it going offensively. You know, uh, they found they found some holes, uh, you know, throwing the football downfield, made some plays and made it interesting. But as we've done all year, our kids really responded uh, and, and rallied and put it away at the end. And, you know, to be here 10-0, I, I think very few people would have taken that bet at the beginning of the year. And uh, I'm unbelievably proud of our staff, you know, our players, our families, and uh, I'm excited to move forward for game 11. And, uh, you know, that first half, keeping Shenandoah off the board, the offense put the ball on the ground a couple times, give up some short fields, but the defense was able to hold Shenandoah off the scoreboard. Just a little bit about how important that was for your defense there in the first half. Well, it, it, it was huge, you know, and, uh, you know, I think it's a mark of a great team that, you know, when, when one side of the football maybe makes some mistakes or struggles, with the other one, you know, lifts them up, and, and we've done that all year. You know, if you look at all our games and, uh, you know, if somebody, somebody struggles or one part struggles, the other side lifts, lifts the other side up, and, uh, you know, I'm very proud of that. And then now, uh, you know, things are in the hands of the NCAA committee. Um, you know, possibility for a home football game in the playoffs. Uh, you know, would you have thought that at the beginning of the season? And then, uh, you know, just uh, a little bit about moving forward in the NCAAs. Uh, well, you know, a little bit, uh, you know, as we began the season, we thought, as I said to the guys, I thought we had a shot. You know, I thought we, we, we had a shot to be a, a good football team. Um, to be 10-0, uh, no, I didn't think that, you know. Uh, but we kept getting better. You know, um, when guys got hurt, other guys stepped up, rang the bell, and, uh, you know, it's it just, it's a, it's a really good mark of how far we've come in a, in a year. And, uh, it, you know, I really credit how hard our kids worked in the offseason, you know, their dedication, their commitment to, to getting stronger, getting faster, and then the commitment to, to our beliefs, you know, and uh, uh, really proud of our guys. Well, Coach, uh, congratulations, 10-0, and uh, good luck moving forward. Thanks, Brian.